we're going to cover the top 20 dynasty running backs Per ADP, this data is hot off the press from DynastyLeagueFootball.com. It's December ADP, which just came out, and we're going to go to the running backs right now. We're just going to go over them real quick, talk about some of the data, and then we'll move on from there. I'm going to do another follow-up video here soon, maybe in the next day or so, covering the market of the running backs here, because I feel like there's a lot of meat to chew on with this outside of just the data covering the market, covering the ups and downs, covering what's about to happen with these college prospects. There's a lot to go on, and I feel like I need to do a part two or a second video. So if that's something you're into, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Hit that now because I'm going to come up with another video recapping, going over the data, and just giving more analysis and more theories on the whole picture at the running back. But let's dig in on these top 20 running backs. So the RB1 right now, Per DLF ADP is Jonathan Taylor. And in August, he was the RB1. He's 23 years old and currently has 861 rushing yards and four touchdowns, 144 fantasy points, and is averaging 14.41 PPR points per game. Now we're moving to the RB2 here, and it's Kenneth Walker, rookie running back for the Seattle Seahawks. He was the RB18 in August ADP. He's 21 years old. 649 yards and 9 touchdowns on the season. Currently has 149 fantasy points, 13.59 PPR points per game. The RB3 in ADP right now is Brees Hall, running back for the Jets. He was the RB7 in August ADP, still just 21 years old. 463 rushing yards and 4 touchdowns on the season, 19 catches, 115 fantasy points, and 16.44 Fancy points per game, and that's in PPR. His season ended early due to an injury. He's on IR right now, and we'll get him somewhere in the middle of next year, hopefully earlier than that, but we just got to see what happens. Moving on to the RB4, and this is Saquon Barkley. He was the RB9 in August. He's 25 years old, has 1,083 yards and 8 touchdowns on the season, also caught 42 balls. 226 fantasy points on the season and averaging 17.42 fantasy points per game. He is currently the RB5. And now for the RB5 and ADP right now, we're looking at Travis Etienne for the Jacksonville Jaguars. He was the RB11 back in August. He's currently 23 years old, 814 rushing yards and four touchdowns on the season, along with 25 catches, 149 fantasy points on the season and is averaging 11.52 PPR points per game. He was running hot for a little bit a few weeks ago and is currently RB19 in total points. Going to the RB6 here in ADP for Dynasty and it's Christian McCaffrey running back for the 49ers formerly of the Carolina Panthers. He was the RB3 in August. He dropped three spots. He's 26 years old. 819 yards and 5 touchdowns and 68 catches on the season. 593 receiving yards and 4 touchdowns. Has 268 total PPR fantasy points and averaging 20.66 fantasy points per game in PPR. So he's dropping you on average a 20 spot every game. The RB7 in Dynasty ADP right now is Nick Chubb of the Cleveland Browns. He was RB13 in August. He's 26 years old. 1,153 rushing yards and 12 touchdowns. 224 total PPR fantasy points, 17.27 PPR fantasy points per game. Total, he's the RB6 right now. That could change by the end of the year. The RB8 in Dynasty ADP, we are looking at Austin Eckler of the Chargers. In August, he was the RB6 in ADP. He's 27 years old, 634 rushing yards and 8 touchdowns. He's also caught... 93 balls so far, 623 yards and 5 touchdowns. He's going to surpass the 100 catch mark sooner than later. He's the RB1 right now in total points. The current RB9 right now in Dynasty ADP is DeAndre Swift of the Detroit Lions. In August, he was the RB4, so he slid a little bit. He's 23 years old, has 375 rushing yards and 4 touchdowns on the season. He's got 31 balls. 131.8 PPR fantasy points on the year and is averaging 13.18 per game. Currently, he's the RB26 in total points. Injuries has hampered him all season long. Now we're at the RB10 for Dynasty ADP, and that is Ramondre Stevenson for the New England Patriots. He was the RB30 in August. He's 24 years old, 742 rushing yards and four touchdowns, has caught 58 
balls. 200 fantasy points on the season. 15.44 points per game in PPR. And overall, he has been the RB9 so far this year. The RB11 in Dynasty ADP is Josh Jacobs of the Raiders. Having a big season this year in August. He was the RB27. He's just 24 years old right now. 1,402 rushing yards on the season with 11 touchdowns and 44 catches. He has 282 fantasy points on the season, and he's averaging 21.75 PPR fantasy points per game, making him the current RB2. The RB12 right now in Dynasty ADP is Najee Harris from the Steelers. In August, he was the RB2. He's 24 years old, 704 yards and 5 touchdowns. He's caught 32 balls. 159 total fantasy points, and he is averaging 12.24 PPR points per game. He is currently the RB17 in overall scoring. The RB13 in Dynasty ADP right now is Joe Mixon of the Cincinnati Bengals. He was the RB10 in August. He's 26 years old with 701 rushing yards and 6 touchdowns while also catching 43 balls. Has 193 points on the season and is averaging 17.59 fantasy points per game. And overall scoring, he is the RB11. The RB14 right now in Dynasty ADP is Derrick Henry of the Tennessee Titans. He was RB14 in August. Not much has changed since then. He's 28 years old, though. 1,199 rushing yards and 11 touchdowns. 20 catches on the season. 244 PPR fantasy points in total. Averaging 18.77 PPR fantasy points per game. And he is currently overall the RB4. The RB15 right now in Dynasty ADP. We are looking at Tony Pollard of the Dallas Cowboys. In August, he was the RB32. He's 25 years old, 894 yards, and 9 touchdowns on the season, along with 29 catches. Has 218 PBR fantasy points and is averaging 16.79 points per game. And he is currently the RB7 in overall scoring. The RB16 in ADP right now for Dynasty is Dalvin Cook of the Minnesota Vikings. In August, he was the RB8. So we've seen a good drop here. He's 27 years old, 950 yards and 8 touchdowns on the season along with 29 catches. Has 191 fantasy points, 14.69 points per game in PBR, and overall he's the RB12 in scoring. The RB17 in Dynasty ADP is Damian Pierce of the Houston Texans. In August, he was the RB33. He's 22 years old, 939 rushing yards and four touchdowns, 30 catches, 166 fantasy points on the season, and is averaging 12.8 PPR points per game. Currently, overall, is the RB15. Next, for RB18 is Javante Williams of the Denver Broncos. In August, he was the RB5. He's 22 years old. He's on injured reserve due to an injury. Should come back mid to late 2023. The RB19 per Dynasty ADP right now is Rashad White of the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. In August, he was the RB34. He's 23 years old. He has 370 rushing yards and 40 catches on the season. 107.2 fantasy points and 8.25 points per game. His value elevated over the last few weeks. Currently ranks in overall scoring as the RB35. And the RB20 in Dynasty ADP right now is Alvin Kamara of the New Orleans Saints. In August ADP, it was the RB12. He's 27 years old, 550 rushing yards, 51 catches, 159 points, 14.48 points per game and is the RB16 in overall scoring. So a quick recap over here. One through five, you got Jonathan Taylor, Kenneth Walker, Brees Hall, Saquon Barkley, and Travis Etienne. The back half of the top ten, we've got Christian McCaffrey, Nick Chubb, Austin Eckler, DeAndre Swift, and Ramondre Stevenson. Then from 11 through 15, we got Josh Jacobs, Najee Harris, Joe Mixon, Derrick Henry, and Tony Pollard. Then to finish off this list at 16, Dalvin Cook, 17, Damian Pierce, 18, Javante Williams, 19, Rashad White, and 20, Alvin Kamara. Very interesting group here. Like I stated earlier, I'm going to drop another video giving you my thoughts, opinions, analysis of the market here of what I think what they're trying to tell us what we probably should do with the picks. But as of right now, drop your thoughts below who you're drafting from this group of players right here, who you trying to get at price, 
Who are you trying to get at a discount? Who are you paying up for? Who are you interested in? I want to hear about it, but make sure you hit that subscribe button on the way out. It's only going to help you going forward because we're going to cover those rookie drafts hard. We're going to cover the rookies hard. We're going to get you ready for the season, the off season, the draft season, any season there is. I'm going to get you there, but I want to thank you for watching, and I'll catch you on the next video.